throw it off. We don't. We're not that desperate. We're not. We don't depend on big evolutions here. So, ooh, spirit leg. That means you can pull a funky combo with this. Evolve. Yes. You know, I want to make sure this is the threat. Even though I do want the Magnemite, uh, it's a still a threat. It's still a threat. I want to make sure if I can attack it, it gets KO'd there. That evolves there, and we could go ahead and use the change clothes. Why do you want to change clothes? Because we can put it on here. Ain't that cool? Alright, so now I could have potentially attacked took an prize guard, but I didn't know that combo com I didn't know that combo was gonna show up there. Well, hello Nogros and the Frenchels. It's Dom. Welcome back to my kitchen. And on today's menu, I'll be serving you the man of many spoons. Get this Mega Alakazam, which Hey, did Ultra Prism do something to Mega Pokemons recently? Yeah, well, the ones remaining in standard, Nagginner will definitely help. Yep, you've seen it with the Mega Hound Doom and a couple others so far. So, removing that Spirit Link, or at least moving it around, makes them much easier to play. And Mega Alakazam happens to have very nice tricks. Remember what this thing did? Yeah, every time it evolves, it hurts enemy Pokemons. Yeah, free ability! When you evolve into Mega Alakazam, one of the bench Pokemons take three damage, and the front Pokemon takes two. Great! And now it's much more smoother, because when evolving multiple Alakazams, move the spirit links around. When your opponent sees this, then this thing's like, oh my gosh, I should remove that stuff. Yeah, so once they move around, you can load up something that helps it, that makes it better. Choice man, 30 more damage against big Pokemons. Does that help you land hit, one hit KOs? Yes, yes, that really makes them playable. So Mega Alakazam, Zen Force, the more damage that they have them already, which is coming from the ability, the more damage it does. 30 for every one, every damage count that they're wounded, so. So three, let's say three, because that's what one of the effects does with the ability. That's, hmm, 100 damage. Eh, that's not enough. What happens if you apply it twice? Six. That's a one hit KO. And with a choice man, so with six, it's 180. 190 with the, with the base damage, and this makes it 230, allowing you to one shot big stage one GX Pokemons. All right, but maybe its ability isn't enough to do it by itself. You need Tapu Koko. Yeah, flying flip. For DCE, you can hurt all bench Pokemons, adding to the damage that you know, all the Pokemon uh, you know, adding to the Zen Force ability. So the ability and Tapu Koko added together makes Zen Force much more consistent. Ah, so we're going to take this guy for a spin. Mm-hmm. And you're gonna see this. Oh man, the first match is really sick. Do not miss that first match. Very much so. All right, so you're in for a good ride. Here we go, let's get started. Yes, welcome to another Mega Alakazam match. I'm gonna play my remix of. This is a new one. Hit, it's a legendary song. <gasps> yeah, should ask John about that. Ready for an opponent to go. Now, I don't have a basic Pokemon here, so we'll see what a real hand is. Uh, luckily, I'm going first, but he'll at least get one extra card. There we go. Pittsburgh is here. It's like, yeah, internet here is the, uh, you know, it's not Pittsburgh's fault. It's a Comcast or some, some internet company that does weird stuff. So Pokemon went down, but hey, it's Arceus. You get an Arceus break soon. No, Prism. They're called Prism now, though. Da, na, 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 na. So, but then I'm out of super front. Mm, but then I can max elixir. I can immediately max elixir that. All right, but then we're gonna have to wait for a retreat. Dang, you only have two float zones in your deck. That's gonna be a little bit problem. Well, why don't we just uh, just deal with the Donald? Yeah, you got Guzmas. You got. You have a coin flip. You have a scoop up. It's gonna be a little... Dramatic way to go home though. So, all right, we have lots of valuable cards here. I wouldn't mind. I don't think I want to use Professor Sycamore here, but you know, I, I do have spares. It's okay. That's true. That's true. 
He is moving really slow. Okay, so let's get started. Here we go. Magierda, Max Elixir. Does it work? It may miss, but if it does work, it is so big. Let's save our cards, because I know I'm going to need those later. Even the Ultra Ball, too. All right, energy. Need a Spirit Link. Let's see if this Max Elixir works. Both of them fail. Complete waste. Let's save this for later. Yeah, I'm not going to get you home back yet. And I'll end my turn right there. So pretty tame. I kind of, you know, I kind of want to burst out that Coco faster with a DCE. Yeah, yeah, so maybe we'll have to worry about that. So, uh, leave it be. Or maybe, maybe, maybe I just have to fuel Psychic Energies. Hmm. Okay, he's moving. I was a little worried here. Little worried. So this is metal. Ooh, wow, two Magnezones go into the discard. So if I take... That feels good because if I take out that Magnezone, I'm pretty gonna be uh, confident it's gonna be the only one there. Now, how are you gonna do that? I guess you spread special, you know, bench damage to it. All right, so we're using this as a retreat next. We, uh, depending on how many cards he's holding, I'll either play, you know, End or Sycamore. Because if I evolve this, if my turn ends, and I don't yet have one of my four Spirit Links, so that's probably gonna come with the next Sycamore or something. Bridget. Oh yeah, Coco. I want to pull DC, I want a Coco, I want to hurt that bench. Uh, I'm pretty safe this turn, but I really got to keep momentum going. So, um, uh, that's Bridget, and he's holding four cards. I'm definitely going to play Professor Sycamore. Now, with these two shuffled back, I don't know if he's got enough time to set that up, but let's go. Uh, yep, we're going to go ahead and try to get a retreat off. It works. Banana Master, you go back home. Set up Mega Alakazam. And let's go ahead and play Professor Sick. We don't want to give our opponent three more draws like this. What do we got here? There's that Coco. So Coco definitely comes down. So does Alakazam. And because I have to Mega Evolve, let's make sure two Alakazams are ready in case he has some insane, insane burst the next turn. In fact... Yeah, I'll charge this up here. Palpad, is it time to Palpad? It's not even time to, no, not, well, yeah, it is, it is. Let's do it, let's just do it. Let's get it over with. Make sure Professor Sycamore and Cynthia's loaded in the next couple of pulls. And not time, really time to Super Hot, but I could get another card with Banana Master. Yeah, we'll just throw it off. We don't, we're not that desperate. We're not, we don't depend on big evolutions here, so. Ooh, Spirit Leg. That means you can pull a funky combo with this. Evolve! Yes! You know, I want to make sure this is the threat. Even though I do want the Magnemite, uh, it's still a threat. It's still a threat. I want to make sure if I can attack it, it gets KO'd there. That evolves there, and we could go ahead and use the change clothes. Why do you want to change clothes? Because we can put it on here. Ain't that cool? All right, so now I could have potentially attacked, took an prize guard, but I didn't know that combo. Com I didn't know that combo was going to show up there. So uh, we evolve again. Still not enough to take this out. Professor's letter. Okay, so I still gonna. Hey, hey, man, it's kind of one shot on me on any of its attack. If the thing gets going, it's gonna be deadly. So I'm, 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 I'm scared. I'm scared. Oh, but the salmon's not the fishy. What? What? What, what fish? I want fishy. You have to. He'll, he'll come back from work. That ooh, an end giving me a whole big nice hand, and all three sycamores come here. It's gonna be Zorark, so he's gonna be here to deal with the uh, Alakazam. Get the first hit too. Not scary, scary. All right, so do you have enough damage to take this off? Maybe. It depends what I pull next. Yeah, we'll definitely get the uh, 40 damage. So let's do some math here. 40. All right, so that does 120 more. Plus, then he has resistance, so it only does 100. So 110 is not enough. It's not enough. All right, so here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna destroy two of the sycamores, cause hey, why, why, you can't use two sycamores. All right, so let's go ahead and do this here. Evolve this, yeah. This may not need some help. Let's go ahead and get the go for Magnuson next. I could retreat too. I probably will. I probably will. Let's go ahead and play a nest ball. What else, D.D. Donald? More Alakazams, of course. 
All right, let's go ahead and play Professor Sycamore. And let's see, we got DCE this time. I could throw him a prize card by using my Coco to attack this turn. That could be worth it. That could definitely be worth it. I don't think I have enough damage to take that off. I don't have a choice ban on me. But a Coco may just do the trick. Let's go ahead and send the Coco out. Coco, go ahead and come out. Let's go ahead and use the change clothes ability. We'll go ahead and put this in our hand right here. Yeah, don't throw it down yet. I could throw it on here, but I just threw that card down. So, let's go ahead and use Fly and Flip. This will give him a prize card. Ooh, the Magnemite's protected, unfortunately. So there we go. Adding a little bit of help for the future Balakazams. And, unfortunately, we... I kind of want more Scoop Cups. Also, it would be nice right now. Yeah, but deck space, deck space, deck space. Trade! Alright, so... I know... I don't know, with two Magnus Zones there, it's gonna be tough. So, down there, he's gonna... I'm not sure if he's... Oh yeah, he's probably... Yeah, Rescue Stretcher, they're coming. They are coming. Okay. We'll see, we'll see. We have two Mega Alakazams ready to trade. Practically three. I don't know. All, all my Max Elixirs... No, all, they all miss. They all unfortunately miss, so... I'll have two Alakazams ready. This last one's gonna be a little bit tough to get out. Alright, now that he's taking a prize card... That feels like he's holding too many cards, man. Yeah. We're gonna do something about that right there. So let's go ahead and drop down the Spirit Link. Drop down Mega Alakazam. Yeah, evolve that. I think it goes through this. Yeah, by attack. So here we go. Knock one of these off. Take a prize card off this. Yay! Alright, take this here. And I'm pretty sure that's enough damage. Let's go ahead and play this down. Yeah, throw the retreat here. Let's Ultra Ball. Let's Ultra Ball. Throw these two cards away, unfortunately. Hey, Turman. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Yeah, we got one more Alakazam. That's another more damage for me, so... And we also still have the stuff, so... Yeah, you're holding too many cards. You make me a little anxious. Come on, wait, Bidam Master, give me one extra card. Might need it. Two removal. Yeah, I don't want your stadium out there. That's gonna be a little critical if he gets to keep that. So let's go ahead now. Let's go ahead and play this, and then we'll change. Uh, we'll change in a bit. All right. Yeah, there's another Alakazam here. So in that case, I'll just change clothes, hold on to this here, and next turn I'll pretty much get four Alakazams on the field. So let's go ahead and use Send Force. Take that out of there. 230. So that's two prize cards now. Yeah! Now all these energies here, but... Uh, hopefully he'll live a turn. That'd be nice. Oh, okay. So, uh, we can... We have... How many goose must I get left? I maybe just want to cheat my way to victory. Yeah, yeah. One more evolu... I also have a de-evolution spray, too. So there we go. Professor Sycamore threw a DC here. He's waiting for the Magnezone to show up. Uh... Actually, we snipe this with a Guzma, that might be a very, very good thing. If he doesn't get this out, because that, that, that would really slow these things out, put them offline, so... Trade! He's been really lucky. Unlucky, I would say that. Yeah. Let's see, we have an opportunity to do that. Oh! Right is beating, okay. I think I should just deal with the threat. Okay, here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna drop the Spirit Link down. We're, we're gonna need this damage, right? Yeah, we do. We do. What happened to your choice man, Donald? I don't know. I don't know. Drop this here. If I do this, there's no way that he can send out another uh, uh, Necrozma. But I'm so close to victory. You are so close to victory. Let's make sure we have this available to go. Let's go ahead and take that stadium away again. What to do? What to do? Hmm. Should I Guzma the Dolmain and just finish it off? How many Guzmas I got left? 
Or should I attack this? And we greedy. I'm gonna get more prize cards if I take this out. One of these out. I think I have enough damage, I think. With the... Let's see, 150. Yeah, I do. I do. I do. Retreat. Send this out. Ah, change clothes. Let me hold on to this card in my hand right here. Alrighty then. So, let's go ahead and use Zen Force. Take that out. I am so, so close to victory. I can smell it. Smells nice. Okay. There we go. One more prize card. One more prize card. This time, Dolan Wing the Crossbow comes out here. Instead of uh, this card. Alright. Alright. I don't have enough damage. The resistance is really bugging me. And no choice man so whatsoever, too. So, yeah, a little, like, oh my god, I gotta evolve this. Ah, dang, eight cards left. It's winding down, but I'm a little out of gas. Ugh, oh, it's always got something here. Rare candy, finally it's up. So here comes the chain one shots. Okay, what do we do? We'll have to see. We don't really have any damage up on this right now. We, uh, we're in trouble. Yeah, we're in trouble. Get the Magnemite! Well played! Oh, you could've took the Magnemite! Yeah, I could've! I could've, but I it was greedy. So... Okay, two removals. Yeah, you gotta take those choice bands away. Alright, so, Magnetic Circuit. That get, makes this available. We're looking for a Guzma to win. That's all we need. Alright. Just holding on here. How many Guzmas I got left? Okay. I also got the evolution spray too. But I won't be able to activate it right away. I might need a Coco. I might need a Coco this, uh, to Coco a turn. Alright, holding on here. Na na na. All right. What, 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 how can you can you win this, Donald? We'll see. Save this here, Donald. How many energies I got left? Probably not much. I don't want. I want to be really careful about that. I got room for Coco. Okay. Here we go. We'll toss the Cynthia. We'll toss Banana Master, cause <laughs> I got to get that Coco out. Just to get us a little softer, hopefully. Okay. Now we need a DC left. How many DCs are left, Donald? Probably enough. <sighs> I don't have that much more damage. Here we go, Cynthia. Let's see what we got here. Alright, if you can hold one more turn, you might be able to do it, Donald. Go, go out. Fly and flip. You two, both of these cars need to stay here with me. Stay here with me, my friend. Do it. Come on. I, I don't care. All right. Playing the two removal for the free retreats. Uh, all right. Well, the Spirit Link. Yeah. Normally, Spirit Links are junk, but because he's been swatching the bag here, and I was like, yeah, they're a little bit deadly. I think I can take out this one guy with the Mega Alakazam. That's a lot of energies. That's a lot of energies. Just all in there. Thank you, you hot too. To keep the great content, I'll try my best. 
Thank you, 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 and it helps out so much. So much, thank you. So, alrighty then, he's shuffling that back into his deck and not pulling it. Bro, no! He's like, oh, he's got an El Guzma in his hand. No, he took away my victory. Lame. Took it away. Oh. You punk. You had the right cards in my hand. Come on, Banana Master. Uh. Thinning. No, oh, and again, please. Okay. Let's unevolve a safe guy right here. Put this on here. A little baiting this. If he's got a Guzma, he'll win. He end me away, my, my, my winning move there. That was too bad. Dragon's like, I can't wait to see your new ideas for new set. I'm got him ready. I got him ready. Ultra Ball for a Lele for a pull. N got me, man. Uh, hopefully that's... I don't see if I'm seeing... That's three Guzma, unless there's a fourth Guzma or an N remaining. That would be ultra bad. That was three Guzma, so that missed. And if he dumps all the energies to take out a Bandana Master, he still has his GX. I don't think he can activate that. I'm not sure. No, you know, it's still expensive. No, everything's still up. We won. We got it. We got it. We got it. We nailed it. Dang. Oh. Yes. Hang on. Minimal move. Evolve this here. Load up that choice man. Load up Guzma for that Lele. Finish it. Send force. Don't need the energy. He knows it. I, I want to get that last attack off. That was close. 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 Call. Oh, we go. <laughs> Alakazam, you did it. You beat one of the main stream meta decks, core decks. You did get a little stuck. So, 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 that's, but still, you did it. You did it. You did it, buddy. I'm proud of you. Welcome to another Mega Alakazam match. Yes, I'm going to play my remix. This is it's a time traveler's theme of a certain doctor. That's enough hints. All right, we're going second. Suda Wuda, watch and learn. Okay, not to worry about here. What is his real stuff? Counter energies, Banana Master, Pasimian. Ooh, so this is a Pasimian deck. I do get weakness bonus, but he has one shots on me and I'm worth two prize cards. Could be a little bit scary here. So, let's see what we got here. We got energy. We got Spirit Lake. We're gonna play Professor Sycamore because I know this is junk and I know, well, I'll need this, but I'm gonna get those seven card pools. What do you need, Donald? Let's get Banana Master up front. Nah, let's... No, no, be safe, Donald. Be safe. Always put Banana Master up front. He's gonna get you more cards through the game. And you're not gonna play Banana Master with Sycamore, because you might get something at your knee. Here we go. Things are clicking nicely. No draw next turn. A little bit scared there. So let's go ahead and get Alakazam up. And we also get a Max Elixir. Why do you eat Max Elixir? Because if it works, it's a big, big, big advantage. So, all right. Now, nothing I can do here. I can just click this for a nice shuffle or a nice look through my deck. Just glancing at it. All right. So, most of the energy is in pulling my hand. I need... I need a way to dump my hand to get the, the, the extra pull there. So, I'll leave me a be here. Doctor. 
Doctor. What kind of doctor? Doctor Who says Velcorak. Ooh, many big pros were using your Glaceon Raichu. Glaceon Raichu is really good. Yeah. Yep, that's my uh, go-to deck if I want to, uh, you know, play until, until I have to react. So, okay. So far, that was a pretty good opening move. Mmm, little hung up in a draw right now, but that's okay. So, it, once he places energy down, I can start attacking very gently, very, very gently. So, I wish it would be a little bit smoother so far. Mew, hey, weakness damage. Ooh, I'm scared. This is one of these non GX decks that, you know, you gotta be terrified about. So, what do we have here? I really need that Mega Alakazam. I gotta pull this before it comes and gets me. So, oh, Banana Master. Sushi Master. The upgrade. Sushis, you know, they take skill, they take time to to make. This is just not a simple banana anywhere, so... It's like, yeah, free kill. If he gets a DCE, he'll just switch in. He'll also need a switch, too, which is a good thing for me. So, I need a first attack. I need to evolve. Yeah. So what 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 plans do you have here, Donald? He's got counter energy, but nobody's taking any prize cards. That's not enough to retreat do anything. So I'm safe this turn, but I really have to top deck something big. Really big. Yeah, because I will be in trouble soon. Okay. Not bad. Tapu Coco. Because I can drop a DC here, I'm also going to be, be able to pull out one of his heavy Pokemon, which is going to be Sushi Master. Send this up, grab an extra card that uses my supporter, but an extra card! It can save me! Another Banana Master! You want more bananas? Two Banana Masters can outdo a Sushi Master! Oh, I needed that turn. So let's go ahead and use Fly and Flip. And this makes it very easy for Alagazam to do whatever he needs to do in the future. So, actually, that's probably good. Yeah, you don't need that Trampa. Use those Cocos. That's pretty good. Who's there? Doctor? Doctor? Who? Exactly, says Malakarak. <laughs> yeah, this is my uh, this is the favorite actor. I'm waiting for the, the next season. That's going to be very interesting to see, too. So, everybody's wounded. Everybody should get one shot at my Alakazam when he comes out. And I'm exposing a pretty weak Pokemon up front. However, I used up my Guzma. I feel bad about that. Next iteration, we're gonna take a. We probably will take the Trumpa out, probably, and just add in the different Cocos, Coco and Alakazam. This last place, hopefully, can go for Magierna. So, he's thinking very slowly and very carefully. Now, what I'm seeing here is that these are all the, not the Pasimian I'm worried about. Yeah, let's see. Once I evolve the Mega Alakazam, this Mew is completely gone, which is great. There we go. That's the one I'm worried about. The one he just pulled. He also has the Brooklyn Hill, too. I don't know if he used that to summon... No, yeah, that could have been free. But it's like, I need to shrink my bench space. So there we go. DC goes on here. He rather pulls a, you know, a float stone. He knows. I mean, he, he's got to get some value out of this immediately. Otherwise, if once I evolve the Mega Alcohol Sam, somewhere, hopefully Professor Sycamore is going to be nice with me. Yeah, it's going to be good. So we're also... We're practically... We probably won't charge up Alakazam. Wow. That was a lot of card pulls. You see that Banana Master? Ooh. He didn't pull anything there. You know, it's a I don't want to destroy another draw support nor my energy counts. I probably get tagged with Coco. So let's make sure two Alakazams are ready to go. There's the Mega Alakazam. I know Magnus is on my prize cards because I haven't seen it yet. So, here we go. There goes a little bit for this. And we click on the Mew. And this will activate his counter energy. So we take a prize card. Come on, Maggie, you know, get out of there. It's gonna be the last cards. So, uh, you know, you know it. So uh, I'll let him keep the stadium, and now we can keep on frying his bench. Yeah, because he's sushi master stuck up front. Ah ha! You, you, you're over, you're heavy. You're overweight. You eat too much. That's why your retreat cost is too much. It's like, I love sushi. It's just so much. I have to eat the food and make the food. That's why I'm a chef. So. Moving on, moving on here. Everything's wounded, everything's like, ah, I'm a one-shot KO, man. If, uh, I probably used to feel blower in my own L Spirit Link soon, and, uh, you know, if there was a, if there was any GX, we'd probably put some choice bands in. You know, 
probably should be a third choice, but man, seven Pokemon Duel is a little bit uh, expensive for this. So, 30 damage here, future Alakazam evolutions would be pretty darn scary. So, right now, yeah, he just wants to go home, get some value, brings out the Alakazam immediately. Yeah, and then, uh, uh, let's see, how much damage does this do? Probably a lot, but uh, not enough to take me down, hopefully. And that gets uh, Sushi Master back out, out there. So once I evolve my next Alakazam, that Sushi Master is gone. And yeah, we can just fight with this team play. That is definitely going to sting. 100 damage. Ah, if you did 10 more damage, we'd be uh, in big trouble here. So let's go ahead and pull throw the Spirit Link on. I'll go ahead and throw the Fuel Blower down. Remove this. Remove my own Spirit Link because it's gone. Of I don't need it. I don't need it. Uh, should I play N? Should I play this? No, there's no, 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 no reason to play that. I also could play, uh... I'll Cynthia. Let's Cynthia. Let's find another Mega Alakazam and get a free KO. Another Mega Alak Alakazam right there. There we go. So we're gonna go ahead and do this. Say yes. That's a little bit of waste, but Sushi Master is gone here. Come on, Magina. Uh, you're, you're, you're the big, big part of this deck, so let's go ahead and see that. Oh! No, no, not this time. Not this time. All right, so you know what? You got another Mega Alizam going for you. Got to throw down these uh, float stones, and we're gonna go ahead and use Zen Force, take the prize card, get this out of here. Yeah. So now that's another prize card. I'm pretty sure this card is gone. Pseudo Wood is gonna take care of it. So uh, we'll be able to finish off the Pseudo Wood in the next attack. It's okay. It's all good. So my Max Elixir is big. I think I have one more Max Elixir. Yeah, you know, two or three, even the, even the Disorder deck here. Okay, so Zuda Wudo is like, ha ha, I'll just copy your Zen Force, and it's gonna hurt. So now flipping this, I got two Banana Masters out here, no Lele's. I wish, I hope I could, wish I could just take out the, that Lele. Ah, uh, some of the cards I wanted are gone. We always, so always have Coco to show up too. Coco. So let's see here. Pseudo Wudo. After Pseudo Wudo's gone, I don't think there's anything that threatens me anymore. And you know what? Some some scoop ups and the evolution spray scoop ups especially could help me out here. He's not attacking. He should have used Watch and Learn, didn't he? That definitely should have used Watch and Learn. I think he, something went wrong there. He's like, ah, oh, I'm out of gas. He could have taken the KO. Maybe. Keep attacking with more watch and learn pseudo widows. Weird, weird, but we'll take it and go. Hey, Mr. Sheep. Hello, Don Bay. Hello, Hitmong Drew. All right, all right. Let us get started. Welcome to another Mega Alakazam match. I'm gonna play my remix's ultimate battle from Mitten Chicken. He'll be using uh, he's today's winner. He's chosen Sogaleel to go against my Mega Alakazam deck, which has 250 HP and a lot of resistance. We don't have an Espeon to deal with this. Espeon would really help me out now, so... Well, I guess we should have thought of that. So, what do we do here? Hopefully we can stack enough damage, and 250 with resistance is going to be a killer for this. So, uh... Keep going. Well... Let's remember to steal. Yeah... If I... Let's see, yeah, 60 hit points. When an Espeon hit, I don't have it in this deck at the moment, so let's go. Okay, play this here. I need to set up my Pokemons. What do we have? We have a Coco. We probably want a Coco out and start weakening the bench line. A lot. There we go. Cheer! Thank you, Racing! Good luck to both of you. Yes! Alright. I'm actually going to put a scoop up right now because I don't want this up front right here. Yes! Oh, I meant to send that up for- whoops! I meant to set, click this guy up. My bad. Okay. So, here we go. Sogaleo. It's gonna take me a little bit more damage to take it, and it also has the max hit points in the game. Not only that, it has one shot on me. Like I said, uh, that's why I'm afraid of it. And a S Espeon may be able to uninvolve these the better. N? Okay, uh oh. I didn't put down Spirit Lake because, hey, it could get too removed. Could be a little tricky if that happens. We, um... Let's see, we have a Max Elixir to the Coco, but that's not what we really want to save it for. Okay, the Alakazam comes out. Let's go ahead and Max Elixir this one right here. And 
And since there's, if I evolve, my turn ends. I don't really want that. Let's do this, use this to get some poke down first. Here we go, Cynthia. All right, oh, we can evolve. Yay. Let's go ahead and toss this down too. I'm gonna go take the front one, okay? Let's take the front one. Let's get the Mecha Alakazam up. And let's go ahead and weaken the guy, the, the one that I've got to build damage on to take away. Bring that up right there. Change clothes. That spirit link is already used up. Let's put it on this instead. You could Ultra Ball and get this up too. That'd be pretty cool. Then what would you ultra what would you ultra ball banana master and get three more cards that potentially that you can play on this turn too? Here we go. Greedy doll. Greedy 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 greedy. Here we go. Pull this here. Three more cards. That's nice. Here we go. Zen Force. Let's take a prize card. Yeah, that's one. That's one. We gotta go as far as possible. As far as possible here. Alright, this comes out, you know, all you gotta do is throw a Heavy Ball in the Ultra Ball, and it's gonna be up. There we go, Sogalu GX is now up. That's a lot to take down. That is a lot to take down, buddy. Yeah. Okay, what do we got? N. That's good, that's good, that's more cards overall for me. So how much, I'm scared of max potions too. That could, uh, let's see. That could, that could really, really be bad. All right, so we'll probably be able to do a two-shot here, but he'll one-shot our Mega Alakazam coming up. I do have another one ready to go. That's good. Unless we really load up on the... get a really nice drop on this. So, okay. Let's see if we can do it. We need, like, all these things to evolve and the Choice Man, and that might do it. I'm not even sure. Okay, make sure this is ready to go. Spirit Link here. Let's throw down everything. There we go, super deck thinning. Oh, that's it. You gotta use Zen Force. It's not gonna hurt so much due to resistance 80, and I think we'll get it if it doesn't max potion or run away. Yeah, yeah. So gigantic, gigantic kings of a deal. Uh, well. Oh, this one's wounded. We gotta worry about the next one. Professor Sycamore. Uh, I'll be able to. There are too many basic Pokemons in my hand right now. I need a draw here. Field Blowers. Uh-oh. Taking away all my Spirit Links. I was throwing them down for Banana Master Pool, but let's see. That's not really all my Spirit Links. They're still there. And I only really need one to work with. So, hey, user undecided. All right. Cosmog. Yeah. Get him up. Uh, let's see what he does here. Sudden Steel Strike. All right. I don't have another Mega Alakazam ready. I lost all the Spirit Link. Okay, I'm doing this to dumping. I'm dumping this card. Double Banana Master. Let's go for another one of these. It's an N. Oh, well, I'm gonna kneel on, land some nice stuff here with this. He's gonna retreat into that no matter what. Let's do this instead. I want to save that there. Here we go, flying flip. Maybe get some little softer damage up there. Yeah, because I don't have the Spirit Link anymore. This little baby, a little, whole, little too risky to throw them all down. I have two more Spirit Links left in my deck. Yep. 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 Can I get Burrito? He says, Agent Silver, Burrito sounds nice. Choice Man. <laughs> yeah, you don't need to have to take care of my babies. 230 is way too big. 270 is a big target to take. And this being worth one prize card may help me a bit. Yeah? 
Okay, so he's got a nice big hand there. And he looks like he's about to run out. Oh, he max potion that way. Yeah. This is a big wall for Mega Alex to have to deal with. Very, very big. Okay, so. Ultra Realm send back. Yeah, he's like, I got time. This is safe. Set on a big giant tank. Refill these Alakazams back to full. I don't know, man. I don't know. They feel back to max HP 260. Oh, boy. He's got free retreat. I don't have a Glaceon this time to block anything. Let's go ahead and throw the... Toss these off. I don't care about the stadium. They don't really help at all, but why not? Tossing this down right here. I'm gonna play Cynthia because I'm gonna need an Ultra Ball for Mega Alakazams and stuff. Alright, I have to throw this down. I don't have my Spirit Links. They both of them, two of them got thrown away. Let's go ahead and throw the Super Rod. Yeah, I'll need you guys back. Alrighty then. So, let's go ahead, you fly and flip. Tickle them. Tickle them, but still, there's a lot of HP to deal with with this. And not only these, both of them, this one's vulnerable to a uh, Espeon. And he's gonna bring the one with energies up one shot at two prize guards. Boom! And he's looking for another Guzma go for the back line. And I think that is going for, for me soon. Yep. Yep. All right. So, we are going to go ahead and get drop another Banana Master down. Let's play Professor Sycamore here. Oh, Spirit Link. Yay. Okay, well, you need this to attack next. Let's go ahead and Ultra Ball. Now, I don't, I don't got time for another Coco Ball. Coco, type of Coco. Or so let's go ahead and toss this down right here. We're gonna use the Spirit Link. Drop this here, get a little bit extra damage up. I guess we might be able to take a prize guard if we take that, hopefully. And I, if he's got another Guzma in this game, I might be just playing for nothing. But let's go ahead and change clothes. This has to go. All right, soften them up. Weaken him a little bit more. He got a Guzma. There's like nothing to stop at that Guzma. Floatstone. All right. Da -da. Da -da -da. Max, but oh, it heals all the way back up. It's like this is a, such a hard wall to climb. Cynthia, it looks like he did not get a Guzma, but it's somewhere. Time is running out for me. I don't have a goose in my hand either. So he's like, it's just waiting for the right guards. Okay. Can send this up here. Energy is no, uh, no, uh, no problem. All right. Here we go. We're going, we do have a Guzma, but we're gonna lose for sure though. I'm gonna take one more prize card before going down, okay? I'm gonna take one more, three more prize cards. I know this is just, I'm not gonna wait for that Guzma. I'm not gonna wait for that Guzma. To come and get me. I'm gonna take initiative, send this out here. Here's your swan song. Boom! You took down, you got, how, much, how far did I get? Three prize cards! Three prize cards! Maybe it's a little bit more of those max potions. So, that is that, and that is going to be game. Alright, Min Chicken. GG. GG. Give it games kicks back up again. Alrighty then. Well, looks like you made it to the end. Thank you, congratulations, it is done, we rate this day. So, let's break it down. Alright, Mega Alakazam, what do we really like about you? What's your unique trait? What's your special deal? And that is this unique combo it has. The combo where it damages with this ability and finishes 
with this attack and they are connected so it's like its own mini game in a pokemon game yeah that's way to put it overall it's a four because it's doing anything uh compared to what other decks do it's less straightforward but it does get the job done so i'd say for equal maybe a little under because of the rigid targeting which we'll get to so damage it's definitely not spamming one-shot kills. You need some time to develop that bench damage and you know, finally get that big one KO. So, eh, there's a, it's not really one-shot. It's not spamming those big, big giant numbers nonstop. So, it's a four out of five. You still have to make the combo happen. So, set up. It's gonna be a four out of five. Maggie Inner definitely helps a lot. But now it's just keeping up with other decks. So, we're still gonna give it a four. Nothing faster, nothing uh, you know, nothing game breaking, but definitely much better. Uh, defense. Let's see, 210 hit points. You know, that's what other uh, GX Pokemon's have. Nothing special again. Zorox got it. So you've aged pretty well. We'll give you normal score four, 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 four. However, the final rating I'll give you a B minus. Something I couldn't really put in there is that the targeting is very rigid. Whatever, you can only hurt things that are wounded, that you've prepared. If something shows up, like a buzz wall, gets max lictor twice, you're not, you haven't prepped it up, you didn't prepare it. So, that targeting is one of the Mega Alakazam's downfall. I mean, yeah, you're making up for people free damage, low energy cost, but not being able to target what you need, because it's not ready, hurts. And that's why it gets a little minus there. All right, Mega Alakazam, you, you know, you had your day. Uh, would I, would I keep on playing this or bring this to a tournament? Mm, no, I'd probably pop it out for fun now and then, but it's not the, it's not a reliable one for sure. So that is that. Anything else? Upgrades. You do have room. You can lower your Alakazam counts, which makes it less Alakazammy, and add in other things. Maybe Trampa. Maybe. No, oh, psychics are getting uh, some new stuff around, so we'll see. But it's definitely a fun one to, uh, you know, to play around with. So that is that. What do you have for next time? You know, I'm working on a tier list, which uh, I'm done with the website. We have to figure out one of the things is to figure out what are the best colorless Pokemon's. I think Drampa still has some game in it. You still see it with, uh, let's see, yeah, you still see it with. Um, Garbodor, so I'm gonna try to make something a little bit different, something that lets Drumpa one shot KO's big GX to the metas. So that'll be for tomorrow. It's awesome. Okay, so that is up for today. Thank you on the Girls of Frenchals. Um, please like, subscribe because I got more good stuff coming for you coming, especially with the new expansion coming in the uh, close to next week, about a week away. Yeah, follow me on social media. I'll be clues when new things are happening. My Discord link is right above me. Yep, it's on the ceiling on the roof too. No, it isn't. Covers on iTunes, Spotify, wherever you like to stream your music, they're gonna be there. So, that is it for today. Thank you on a gross of Take it easy, stay safe, and I'll see you guys next time. Thank you, bye-bye.